So you want to start reading comic books, but you don't really know where to start or when to start because nobody really told you anything except for, oh, you should read this comic book or you should read that comic book or this comic book is so good, you should definitely read it. But you don't know the story. You don't know the origin of, for example, Justice League or Batman or whatever you want to start reading. You don't know the origin story. You don't know who they are. You don't know what makes the character the character and you want to get to know that. Well, you have reached the right place. I'm going to tell you every single thing that I wish that somebody would have told me when I started reading comic books. I'm going to try to make this as quick as possible because I know that you don't really want to listen to a guy who you don't know. You just want to start reading comic books and I totally respect that. But I have to say this and I'm really sorry, but I really have to. If you like my videos, click that subscribe button and hit that notification so you never miss out on another video ever again. So to start reading comic books, you need to understand that there are some issues and there are overall big stories. And one issue is like one book and in a story, it can be from one book to maybe 5,500, it doesn't really matter how many, but a story is very big and you need to understand what you're getting into when you actually do it. So for example, the Avengers, you don't really want to start with Civil War where they have Captain America versus Iron Man, Team Cap versus Team Iron Man, because you're not really going to understand anything because there's so many characters and a lot of characters take sides and it's a gigantic story. You need to understand everything before you start reading it. So I'm going to give you an example as Batman, all right? When I started to read Batman comics, I just threw myself in there. What's the best Batman comic? And I just read it, all right? I didn't really understand anything because I don't really know Batman. I didn't really know him like that. I knew him from like movies and stuff, but I didn't know what made Batman tick. I didn't know his origin. I didn't really... Obviously, I knew his origin, but like, you know what I mean. I didn't know everything about Batman. So to start reading a Batman comic, I would recommend you start with Batman Year One, a great origin story for the Batman and one of the best comic books of all time. So now you have the origin. Where do you continue? To be honest, it doesn't really matter, but I would recommend that you don't start with like, a story or a, like an issue book where there are multiple issues and like 20 40 issues with one story because you're going to tire yourself out and you're not going to finish it so instead what you would do is you would start with something like maybe one issue maybe two issues and work your way up so that you won't tire yourself out that you can actually hang and actually do what you do and you can read more and more and more and more because it is a lot. You have to read a lot. And now when you feel comfortable with the character, you know the story, you know stuff like that, I would recommend that you start reading some of the better known uh, comic books. For example, with Batman, The Court of Owls is a great one. Batman, Death in the Family, another good one. Maybe Death of the Family, a great one as well. To give you a quick recap, start small, start with an origin story. It doesn't matter what type of origin story and it doesn't matter when it was released. All right, as long as you find one origin story, read it, then read another one. As long as you find one origin story, read it and then you start small maybe one or two issues and then work your way up. Otherwise, you're going to tire yourself out. Start small. I believe in you. You got this.